Hey y'all, it's me. Air front Elijah, Gadget Hunter. And I got something very special in this big old box right here. All right, let's hold off on this for just a sec. Air front Elijah, Gadget Hunter. Some of you may know I host America's favorite Apple podcast. It's called The Cult Cast. I'll put a link in the description down below if you want to check it out. I've been podcasting for like seven years now, almost seven years. I'm always on the lookout for cool gear, cool mics, mixers, what have you. One of my favorite companies out there right now making audio equipment is called Rode. They're based in Australia. They're down there. They're making great audio equipment. They're throwing shrimps on the Barbies. They're having a great time. They recently came out with a product called the Rodecaster, and it's an amalgamation of a bunch of really cool podcasting technologies all fused together into one machine. The Rodecaster is part mixer, part recorder, part soundboard. It's a plug and play device that you just plug right into your computer and you can record yourself, you can mix all your audio, and you can even connect it to your phone so that you can record phone calls if you're talking to someone over Skype or on your phone or something so that you can bring them all into your podcast. It's a very exciting piece of equipment. So Rode offered to send me one of these beautiful Rodecasters and I said, sure, why not? I'll check it out, Rode. But they sent me this ginormous box I've got sitting right here. I have no idea what's inside. Let's do a little unboxing. First impressions of the equipment. Let's get into it. How are we gonna do this? Okay, here we go. This is better. Let's just go ahead and bust this open. Okay, first things first, the Rode microphones envelope full of, I'm sure is engaging marketing material. Let's put this down here. Holy moly. We got what is essentially a slideshow of how to use the, the Roadcaster, full on instruction cards. I feel like I'm on the Jimmy Fallon show helping him do his ad read here. Oh, there's something, there's something real big in here. What the hell? <laughs> a ginormous Roadcaster backpack so that you can take the Roadcaster with you wherever you go. Podcast, wherever you go. Is that it? Yeah, that's all that's in here. Okay, let's just go through this thing one pocket at a time. Top pocket. Top pocket. Nothing in here. Main pocket. Whew, baby. Okay, here we have the Roadcaster. And it is surprisingly small. I thought this was gonna be much bigger than this. Here's the reason why the Rodecaster is such an exciting product. It does a lot of things that you would normally need multiple pieces of equipment to do. And they also say it has fantastic sounding preamps. Now preamps are key. When you're doing an audio only podcast, you need the audio to sound real nice. They say this has class A servo biased preamps. I don't know what any of that means. All I know is I'm gonna have to plug this in and see what it actually sounds like. Here's the board itself. You can control all your mixing functions on these little sliders. Here's a really cool piece. You can actually assign sound effects to these buttons and then pipe these sound effects into your podcast as you're doing it. Now the sound effects thing sounds like it's pretty easy to do. You would be shocked if you knew how much work you had to go through just to bring an effects board into your podcast that you can hear, that your guests can hear, and that actually make it into the recording, it's not easy. So having the functionality build right into the board right here, it puts my nips at full mast. Ooh, we got four XLR jacks on the back. We have four headphone jacks on the back so your guests can hear themselves. We also have the SD card slot right here. So you can pop in a micro SD card and you can record your entire podcast. This board literally does it all. It's compact, it's lightweight. I love having actual knobs on the board. This is something that makes a difference. When you're in the heat of the moment, you're making a podcast. Someone's making a point that you know is gonna go viral and you need to crank it up so everyone hears what that person's saying. You need to have some actual hardware to move things along up and down so that you don't have to think about it. So I really like all the buttons all over this thing. Not too big, takes up a relatively small amount of desk space, also like that. And look at that big, beautiful record button right there. Uh, yeah, uh, just, you know, uh, yeah, right there. You know when you're recording, you know when you're going live, you know when you're making the content. 
that everyone is gonna love. Ooh, Slick Willy, check it out. You also have a way to mute each track and solo each track so you can hear exactly what's going on or pull that sound out of the mix. Okay, let's see what else is in this backpack. Now this is a big bag. There's gotta be some other goodies in here. It looks like we have a back department here. I see something very special in here. Okay, so first of all, they sent me a DS1 mic desk stand. These things are handy. I prefer the mic arms that actually go on your desk and have a retractable arm. I actually use a Rode mic arm for that exact purpose right now. It's kind of swing it around, you know, get it right up in your face so that the people can really hear your voice. But these are handy in a pinch, especially if you have guests coming by every once in a while. These things are really handy to have around. Thank you, Rode. What's this? Oh, we got another desk stand. I only have one friend, so I'll probably just keep this in storage for now. Now there's gotta be something else in here. This backpack is huge, and I feel like I might be missing something. Uh-oh, I found it. There's a whole nother compartment. Oh, baby. Oh, baby. Here's the good stuff right here. The Roadcaster Pro T-shirt. Ladies and gentlemen, wah, 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 wah. Let's see what size it is though. They gave me an XL. Road, I work out almost every day of the week. I wear a medium. I've got massive buys. I can make my pecs bounce faster than Terry Crews. This is gonna be too big for me, Road, but I appreciate the sentiment. Oh my, uh, we got one. We've got two. I believe these are microphones. I'm not sure which they are, but I think these are Rode's new podcasting microphones that they just came out with. These are Rode Procaster microphones. Let me just tell you this. I actually don't know much about these mics, but I have a Rode Podcaster microphone. In fact, let me get it. Girl. This is the Rode Podcaster and it holds a very special place in my heart. I've been podcasting for about seven years now and I've been using this mic almost the entire time. It served me well, it sounds great. It's a USB microphone. It's a great starter mic because it's so easy to use. You just plug it into your Mac or your PC. Even compared to some of the more expensive microphones I'm using these days, this mic holds its own against those and it's only like $250. Okay, we gotta look up these mics because I'm actually not sure which model this is. Yes, okay, mm-hmm. This is the Rode Procaster Broadcast Dynamic Vocal Microphone. It has a five-star average review on Amazon. These are tuned to make your voice sound creamy, smooth for all of your podcasting purposes. These are great microphones and I'm actually surprised that Rhodes sent me not one, but two of these mics. I feel like a very, very lucky boy. I had no idea that Rhodes was sending me a whole bag full of absolutely elite tech gear. I can't wait to review this stuff. As I said, I've been using Rode for years. I've been using one of their shotgun microphones for my YouTube videos. I've been using their Rode Podcaster for my podcast for years. They make great equipment. If you want to hear my reviews of these upcoming products, make sure you hit that subscribe button. Do it right now. Also, check out my podcast, America's favorite Apple podcast, The Cult Cast. Link in the description down below. We talk about Apple news every week. We have a great time. We make all sorts of really funny jokes and we talk about tech. I've rambled on long enough. My name is Aaron Elijah, Gadget Hunter. I'll be on the prowl for more gadgets and I hope to see you in the jungle.